Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to New Jack City. Today, we are talking about the baby, Tory Lanez, and Megan Thee Stallion. All right. Now, before I get into this, uh, I did make a short video as usual. So, you guys, if you guys don't want to see the in depth video of what, what I'm about to do right now for eight minutes, you guys can just, you know, check out the news real quick. It's one minute, gives you a brief update and a brief of my like how my thoughts on it but this goes into the full in depth but having that being said it says the baby claims he had sex with megan the stallion the day before tory lanes allegedly shot her is anybody surprised i think it's always been a rumor i mean not a rumor but i think it's always been kind of known that Megan the Stallion and the baby kind of had something going on y'all have to think about this Megan the Stallion is the woman who made up hot girl summer so and the baby and both of them having that being said both of them was both on the rise at the same time <clears throat> their career started so of course she's gonna mess with the baby the baby's been on like you know like two three songs damn this damn camera I'm sorry y'all I gotta stop moving anyway um yeah uh the baby has been on the rise with megan the stallion for a cool minute so of course that's going to that was bound to happen like it's not i don't see that as being a surprise really like that like it was bound to happen now here's my thing i believe that the baby you know mentioned this on the song right now because right now the baby is not that hot if y'all don't know the Danny Lee really did a number on him. The uh, LGBTQ comment that his DJ said really did a number on his career. And then all the, uh, you know, the fights he's been getting into as of late. Like now people are starting to see the baby as kind of like the problem, <laughs> pun intended. But nah, what is it called? Yeah, people are really starting to see him as a problem. So he's not getting as much traction as he was because I don't I don't know if y'all remember, but he was on SNL, you know, he was doing he was doing sell out sell out shows and stuff like that. And right now, I mean, I still still think that he can sell out a show. Don't get it. Let's not get that twisted. The baby is still hot, but um, I think he, he can sell out a show, but he's not going to get like the honestly, I look at the baby's career as kind of like the Chris Brown career. Chris Brown at one time, he was at this hot. He was at high of all highs. No one could really mess with Chris Brown when he first came out with the, uh, you know, his first album and his second album. Right after that Rihanna thing happened, that Double Mint Gum commercial, he lost that. He lost a lot of the, you know, he was kind of like the, the good boy, the up and coming Michael Jackson. So he had like the Good Samaritan type of, you know, sticker on his, uh, on his personification, on his artistry. Now, when he lost that, you know, he just went thugged out. Now we got the Chris Brown that we got now. Having that being said, I still love Chris Brown, but you know, he was a good boy when he first came out. The baby, because he's always, you know, because he's in rap, he never had that good boy type of, you know, uh, sticker on him, but he was known as the a real N-I-G-G-A. And people could respect that, right? But even the LGBTQ community, they could they could respect that as well. But once he once his DJ bashed them. And then, you know, the whole Danny Lee happened, the Danny, Lee, the Danny Lee situation happened. And remember, we are definitely living in a feminist world right now. Yeah, his career wasn't, you know, his career has never been the same after that. So a lot of people ain't really checking for him like that. I still like the baby, but, you know, that's how it is. Having that being said, to get to the Tory Lanez situation. Tory Lanez, I think he doing the Birdman hand rub right now <laughs> because... Megan Thee Stallion ain't looking good right now, bro. He's not. Having that being said, he ain't looking too hot himself. I mean, this is low-key kind of a W in his corner with the whole Megan Thee Stallion case. But, you know, this August Alcina situation that happened and then him saying that, you know, I don't know what this boy is talking about. I was in the studio the whole time and obviously you got caught on camera smiling, doing a dance, the happy dance after, you know, you put hands on him, him and your, you and his security guard. You catching too many L's out here, Tori, to be 100 with you, bro. And, um, you know, this is kind of a dub right now because it's like 
Megan Thee Stallion is looking like, well, first off, you know, she already lied about the situation of her being, you know, involved with Tory Lanez, but now that she didn't even bring up the subject of, you know, him and her and the baby um, being in this situation, and now that I think about it, now that I think about it, hold on, Megan Thee Stallion got mad at the baby for doing a feature with Tory Lanez. I forgot about that, yeah, because I reported on that. So she got mad at the baby for doing a feature with Tory Lanez because of you know him allegedly shooting her or whatever and they was in a i mean they was in a whole entanglement the whole time so were you really mad that he did a feature with tory lanes or was you mad that the dude that you mess with the dude that you the dude you mess with right now and the dude that you used to mess with after you know he so-called shot, allegedly shot you y'all collabed and did a feature so obviously you know it might have been some you know some pillow talking Maybe that's why she was mad that the baby did a, a feature. Because, I mean, you already know when guys get around, we do talk. And we talk about, you know, who we smash and stuff like that. And obviously, Megan Thee Stallion had to have got brought up in the studio. Now, having that being said, Tory Lanez did say he did that months before this whole, you know, alleged thing came out. He just, I mean, the alleged shooting came out. He just finally put it out during that time. But even with that being said, they must have talked about Megan Thee Stallion. They had to. They had to. <laughs> They're too close together. It makes any it doesn't make any sense. And we've all known that Tory Lanez and Megan Thee Stallion was kind of like a thing. Like not together and stuff like that, but you know, it's been a thing. But, you know, this is uh this is very interesting and very messy. That's all I have to say. And uh the whole Megan Thee Stallion situation, you know, I don't know anybody who would try to claim that. That's why I believe Tory Lanez and the baby didn't claim that because who would want to claim a girl who made up literally the most the most thoughtish thing that you can do hot girl summer like no one's going to claim that except the dude that you with right now but see what i believe is there's certain there's two type of guys there's the baby and tory lanes and then there's the party or whatever whatever guy she's with i think his, his name is party or whatever but see that dude he had to have he had to be with her because megan Stallion was like bro you're not that popping like that and if you want some of the, if you want some of the kitty cat, you're gonna have to wife me because I'm tired of being a thought out here. So he was the type of dude he had to wife it. And as you can see, you know, he kind of a lame. And then you have the the baby and Tory Lanes who's already lit, and then they're not wifing you at all because they have standards and they're not going to be with a girl who, you know, said uh, you know, this is hot girl, I'm on my hot girl summer ish. No, you're not gonna he's not they're not gonna be with that. They're gonna be with a girl that's low key. Hell, Danny Lee was low key at a time. That's why the baby was with her. Tory Lanez, we ain't never, I've never even seen him claim a chick to be 100. So, you know, that's what I believe. But what do y'all think? Do y'all think Megan Thee Stallion is, uh, I mean, do you think the baby is lying about this? Do you think Megan Thee Stallion was keeping this under wraps? And, you know, is she going to come out and tell the truth that her and the baby was kind of a thing? And how do you think Tory Lanez feel? Leave it in the comment section. Give this video a big thumbs up. And please subscribe to the channel, all right? I will see you guys next time. All right? Living, living just enough.